Wow, after all these months, I'm finally approaching Alpha Centauri, being crammed in this rocket ship this whole time. Oh, it's, com oh, it's, it's coming into vision right now. Oh, look how beautiful that is. A gem in the middle of all this darkness. It's time to engage the landing procedure. I better start now. Oh, something, something's wrong. Something! Ah, ah. Ejecting astronaut. Uh oh. Ah! Oh wow. It's so serene out here in space. So quiet and so vast. Look at all the stars out there. Oh my goodness, what a strange feeling this is floating out in space. I remember this feeling. I know exactly when that feeling was. It was at the moment of being born. And when I was coming out of my mother, all of a sudden the doctors cut my umbilical cord that tethered me to the mother, and I was floating free in space, and how terrifying that was. Lost from my source, disconnected from everything I've known for my whole life, floating away in that hospital. The fear of disconnection, being lost from the mother. And this is why it's so important to understand the nature of conscious parenting and the birthing process. The birthing experience itself is so vital for the life of the child. In a happy birthing experience, a child comes into the world without so much stress and so much happiness being connected to its mother. But when there's interference in that birthing process and the child is taken away from the mother, the fear of that experience, the loss of connectivity to life is so profound and it is memorized. Just try to imagine what that baby will experience when its umbilical cord is cut and it's taken away from its mother. It'll be something exactly like this, lost in space, tumbling with no connection to its life support system. This fear of the loss of life at the moment of birth will be carried through the lifetime of this child because it becomes a program in the subconscious mind, the fear of loss of connection. In the birthing process, the natural childbirth, where the child, when it's born, is not disconnected from the umbilical cord, but the child instinctively will climb itself up the mother to the breast and start nursing itself. This is a very important aspect for the psychology of this child for the rest of its life. And more than that, it's even an important health issue because the process of the baby crawling up on the mother inoculates something called the microbiome, which is a functional part of this child's life cleaning up the baby, cutting the umbilical cord, and taking that child away from the mother is a source of frightening energy to this baby that's just being born, losing contact with its source. The whole benefit of going back to natural childbirth is recognizing the physiological, the biochemical, the energetic and spiritual connections of what birth is to an individual. That to recognize that when that baby is in contact with its mother after it's born, it's not lost in space, it's still in contact with its source. And in that source, it receives pleasure of being held in security. And this is what's carried through the life of a child that is given an opportunity to be born through natural childbirth. Even consider the beyond that physiology, the nature of the chemistry of oxytocin. When that baby is holding on to the mother skin to skin, when that baby begins to nurse itself, the oxytocin released by the mother bonds her so deeply to that child, and yet at the same time, the oxytocin release in the child's brain bonds it to the mother. This bonding is a bonding of security. The earliest life experiences of that child, especially during birthing, affect the nature of stress. And the relevance is that when a child is stressed, the hormones from that child will shut down the immune system, will shut down the conscious thinking of that child. So a child that is brought into this world in high stress is already at a disadvantage, losing its ability to maintain its health and its vitality. And all of a sudden you could start to see when a child is taken in with love and contact with the mother, that all of a sudden there's another way of seeing how calm that child is. In fact, how calm I feel now, out here without all that stress. Look how beautiful this universe is. Uncle Bruce.
Uncle Bruce? What? 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 What are you doing? What? Where am I? You're in the backyard. Boy, just a minute ago I was lost in space, Alex.